today's video I'm going to show you how to do a remote desktop connection from Windows 11 to Mac OS Catalina 10.15.3 okay so this is my Windows 11 desktop and this is my Mac OS Catalina 10.15.3 so for this uh, we need to do two things in Mac in Windows 11 you need to install real VNC viewer so we have two th in real VNC we have two things one is uh, VNC server and VNC viewer so we will be connecting from Windows 11 to um, Mac OS okay so we need a real VNC viewer which will actually connect to Mac OS okay and you have to configure the remote desktop uh, which you can say the real uh, VNC server in Mac OS Catalina so first <coughs> let us go to the Mac and just a moment and let us connect to let us close this so you can see it is version 10.15.3 so we will go to the system preference and from here you can just click on sharing you can do like this or you can just click on system preference and click on sharing see in the left hand side pane we have a couple of things here so we have screen sharing here so I'll be uh, it is already selected okay so I'll be going here in the screen sharing and here I have you can see allow access for all users only this user so I have uh, for uh, if you if I'll select the only this users here we have the administrators but I'll be configuring for my local user okay not the administrator so you can see I have my local user this is my name uh, this is the user okay I'll select this and click on select now it is there and here computer settings click on this and VNC viewers may control screen with password so you should provide a password here <coughs> now I'm done okay so this is done so let's close this and let's go to our in Windows 11 here I'll uh, open the real VNC see uh, in real VNC what you have to do uh, I'll provide you the download link for the real VNC viewer okay so you can download it from there so after you open this you have to sign in actually you have to create an account I already got an account here okay so what I'm going to do I'm going to log in without login it is just like uh, if you have used the um, team viewer it is just like that okay sign in for the first time uh, they will verify you have to there will be an email verification you have to verify with the email and register this um, particular PC which you have been accessing so I already have it here see 192 168 29 31 so uh, what I will do I will delete this okay and create a new connection okay IP address 192 168 29 31 for confirmation let us go here and open the terminal and just do a if config okay you see we have this 192 168 29 31 okay so let us go here and name mac OS Catalina okay suppose 10 1 5 3 okay encryption blah 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 is there picture quality I'm just uh, not doing any con con configuration you configure it I ju I'm just showing you how to make a connection so click on OK and connect 
I'll provide the username. Username is Subranil. That is the full name. I have shown you that uh, Subranil Gangul is the full name. Actually, username is Subranil. Password I will provide here. I'll remember the password. Okay. Okay. Now I have connected to the Mac. So this is how you connect from uh, Windows 11 you are using real VNC viewer to the Mac so I've shown you how to configure again let us go here and uh, click on system preference this is for enabling your desktop connect remote desktop connection click on sharing okay in screen sharing you have to add this user here you click on this see I have already uh, uh, added the shipping language all the users are added so these are disabled no new user are there and from the computer settings you have to you can provide a password custom password here so control screen with password anyone may request permission to control screen okay so this is how we connect to Mac OS Catalina 10.15.3 remote desktop from Windows 11 okay so if you like this video please like and share and also subscribe to my channel thank you so much